I have built the White House in Minecraft. I built the Washington Monument in Minecraft. But I have not built the Capitol building in Minecraft. But don't be sad, you little bambinos, because that changes right now. We are building the United States Capitol on my Washington, D.C. super map. I'm excited. I don't know about you guys. Let's get right into this build. And here we come. We're flying in here. We're getting started right away. You're going to see a lot of circles being uh, crafted in this video because there are a lot of circles around this build and you can see I'm not wasting any time at all I'm getting right into this big freaking build here and uh, you can see that this cold capital building is sort of plopped up on this big pedestal platform here that's because it is on a hill um, believe it or not Capitol Hill is in fact on a hill so the west side the side that I'm on right now is lower than the east side so it got this nice platform to keep it on a keep it on level ground here but here we are I'm building the actual building first uh, first off right away and then we're gonna come and uh, detail all the area around it so um, nothing too uh, too special or crazy here I'm just uh, doing a lot of nice detail work like you've all seen me do time and time again on this channel um, and this building is pretty symmetrical um, I will say it's not as symmetrical as uh, when you first look at it because the east side uh, which is the side that I'm working on right now is different from the west side so I had to do two uh, two different pretty uh, two different sides here um, two different detail types two different sort of uh, uh, facades and um, took a little bit more time but that's all right I'm fine with that uh, it, it looked it looks pretty good in the end so I'm happy with that um, and that's pretty much the actual all exterior walls pretty much done right away and this is probably the part that's going to uh, be the coolest here right away uh, the, the the dome the big famous dome obviously uh, everybody wants to see the dome it's big it's fat it's awesome it's juicy and uh, here's a little tidbit that I figured out here uh, while building this um, these windows on the Capitol Dome um, one of them one of the sets of windows are real but I think the set that I'm building right now these are actually fake windows so they don't look into anything they're just there for decoration so uh, very interesting tidbit there for you guys um, in case you didn't know uh, some of those windows are just fake um, so there we go and we're coming up to the top here and getting this big statue on top finished and just like that the freaking dome is done so uh, that was a, a really quick um, build for the Capitol building so uh, I guess if that's all you wanted to see you can click off now but please don't please watch this video uh, there's a lot more things to, to do to do in this video um, a lot of exterior work, a lot of detail work, and it's going to look fantastic. Here we go. This is sort of the place where, like, um, when the president gets inaugurated, uh, this is the place that they do it at right here. Uh, there's a bunch of usual seats. Usually there's a bunch of seatings, and uh, it looks pretty cool there, and that's fun right there. And then we are detailing this whole big platform pedestal thing that the Capitol building stands on. And you can see me right here, I'm adding in some planters, which is fantastic, and those little uh, bits of diorite with pressure plates on top. Those are supposed to be lamp posts. Um, it's a kind of a new take on a lamp post that uh, I'm trying out here. I think it turned out pretty nice. Um, there's actually no sea lanterns or glowstone or anything in this build. Uh, I just used um, sort of blocks like that, and then I used light blocks to, uh, to just plop on top of that to imitate a light source. So I think it turned out pretty nice. So there we go. And now I'm here building the actual hill. Like I said, Capitol Hill is in fact on a hill. So I do create that elevation right there. And bada bing, bada boom, just like that. And then we have this big open field with nothing going on in it. So now we have to fill it all out. Right here is a uh, pool. Or it's not a pool, but it's a, a little water, water area. Um, I don't remember what it's called. Um, so forgive me for that but here are some roads and stuff and the, I will say these roads and these pathways going around the Capitol building were actually uh, like 10 times harder and more tedious to build than the actual Capitol building itself because you'll see there's a bunch of them they're curvy they're wavy you can see I'm getting a bunch of big circles in here and everything um, so I had to uh, you know plan it out and and uh, and do a lot of angle work as you can see already so there's a lot of geometry and a lot of curvature to, to work with in these pathways here so um, very interesting stuff here and it, it does look very nice in the end so uh, I, I don't care that I had to do a little bit extra work you can already see it looks really nice 
Uh, once I flip it with World Edit and it looks symmetrical, everything looks nice and freaking dandy as can be, so um, I'm fine with that. And now we are coming in and adding all these nice little trees and foliage and grass and bushes and all that fun stuff. And you can see the beautiful Capitol building in the background here. These trees just complement the building and make this place look a hundred times better. It makes it look really alive and it fills this place out. So um, I'm really happy with how this place turned out in the end. I will say I probably like 80% of this build project uh, was me adding leaves to these trees because there are freaking trees everywhere here. And uh, you will see that as this video progresses. There are a lot of trees to be built, but do not worry, it was worth it in the end. It, it really turns out really nice and really pretty, and these cinematics would not be the same without all these awesome trees living up the place here. So here we go, coming to the other side, adding in a lot more trees, a lot more, uh, I guess, uh, leaf cover onto this big open field, making it look super, super awesome. And then after these trees here, um, I can't remember, I think we might come and work on the um, sort of monument memorial here. Yeah, right here. This is the uh, Ulysses, Ulysses S. Grant Memorial that uh, I'm going to get up right here. This is just like a little statue here um, with, a, with a Ulysses S. Grant, I have to assume, uh, on a horse here. And it looks really nice. Really uh, a really good uh, sort of, um, I don't know, uh, 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 topper onto the cake that is the Capitol building. A, a nice little memorial monument right here um, just plopped in the middle of the video um, no big deal just uh, just adding it in here just for you guys a um, little extra credits uh, tidbit there for you and then here we go we're getting some little statues in this roundabout right here um, so there we go getting a little bit of road detail and then we're coming on to the other side of the Capitol building and I will say right here um, in a few moments that you are you are going to see um, a lot of progress done immediately and that is because one of my replay files corrupted uh, as it was rendering, so I lost it all. Um, just before my very eyes, it disappeared like it was freaking, uh, you know, some magician, like it was David Blaine, just disappeared before my eyes. So that's unfortunate, but you're going to see a lot of tree work and bush work and uh, path work get done immediately. But the stuff that you can see right now, this is sort of, I think this is a new addition to the Capitol building. It is the Visitor Center. So if you're like coming to tour the Capitol, um, this is the side that you would come in on and, and uh, you go uh, and take tours from this side of the Capitol. And uh, it looks pretty nice and uh, I am happy with how it turned out. And uh, a lot of elevation change still even over here. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I am happy with how it turned out. And then here's a little road here coming up and uh, you know, coming, coming all around. Uh, wavy roads, wavy pathways like I said. And here we go getting all the hill and this is the last part of the hill work so that's fun we have an actual solid ground to work with here and there we go bada bing bada boom and then like I said uh, I lost a lot of the recording so we are jumping ahead here so on the left side you can see all the trees there that is part of the recording that I lost so no biggie it is what it is just a little bit of tree work nothing you guys haven't seen before but here we are back at it with the paths and making some nice little intricate pathways going uh, left, right, center, here, there, everywhere. And, uh, you know, it, it's just uh, a little bit more work to uh, make this place look super pretty, super pretty. And the final trees in this whole Capitol building area are going up. And uh, it looks really nice. And then just like that, we're coming onto the inside here. So I made, uh, I ended up making three big uh, pieces of the interior. I made the rotunda. Uh, which I'm gonna build first here and then I built the House of Representatives and then I built the Senate so uh, I'll get into those a little more when we get there but right now I'm just making the whole floor plan uh, with um, this whole building here so these are just a bunch of like random offices and stuff like that that you saw me lay out here but here is the rotunda that uh, I'm gonna start off building here first uh, it looks a little dark here just give it a moment and uh, it'll light up right quick. Here we go, looking beautiful. And uh, notice how it pans up and uh, all the detail just starts to fill your screen and it looks really nice. And there is the first set of windows. Uh, if you remember a few moments ago, I said one of these sets of windows on the Capitol Dome is real and one of them is fake. So this is the real one. And then you'll see the one uh, set of windows above it uh, obviously has nowhere to shine through because the dome is kind of just blocking the view. So uh, there you go. The, the windows are fake, in fact. Um, 
it is what it is. Uh, it, it, it's tough to be a window on the Capitol building, I guess. But uh, there we go. And then here we are coming to the very tippity top of the rotunda and adding in that nice little uh, art piece up in there. And look at all this detail. Holy smokes. Uh, there we go. Just, just like that. We got a whole rotunda detailed up and looking nice. And then this is the House of Representatives. And forgive me for a second there. It was a little bit dark. Um, this new shader pack that I was trying out uh, uh, is a little bit dark. Uh, when there's no light here. But here's the House of Representatives. This is where El Presidente gives his State of the Union speeches and uh, some other important stuff I'm sure happens uh, in here as well. So there we go. Bada bing, bada boom, getting all these rows of seats. And one thing that I uh, discovered here when I was building this is that the House of Representatives and the Senate, uh, th both of these rooms have these upper decks here that are just like going all the way around and they're just seating up there. And people just sit up there. I didn't. I didn't know that those existed. I've never seen those before. So, very interesting. It's like an arena. It's like a. It's like your your front row seat watching a freaking WWE fight. But it's just that. It's just important people talking about stuff. So there you go. We got seating going all up the wazoo all around here. And yeah, you can see all these nice little wall details and all that fun stuff. And it looks great. It looks fantastic. So there we go. We got the House of Representatives there. And then the final piece of this big old fat build before we get into some nice cinematics here uh, is the other side of the Capitol building. I am built the Senate Hall um, and here we go. Uh, it's pretty similar to the House of Representatives uh, in the way that it looks but uh, it's just a little bit designed differently. It's a little bit lighter. You can see I use some sandstone on the walls and uh, very nice. It also has this upper canopy deck uh, here for the extra seating here and that uh, you can uh, watch your WWE arena fights but there we go we're gonna get into some nice little cinematics here calm little cinematics of these capital grounds thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed smash that like button smash that subscribe button check me out on patreon join the discord I hope you guys have a fantastic day stay tuned for the next video and until then goodbye Thank you, patrons. I could not do it without you. Thank you all for your support. And thank you to my top tier patrons, Delkin Melville, Iron Man 2017, Voe, and of course, Walker Army. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day and goodbye.